Hi, in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to change your currency on Etsy website. So first of all, of course, all you need to do, just go and open the browser that you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. So of course, here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser, could be possibly working for you. Once you open your browser, just go here to the URL section and type etsy.com and hit the enter button. That will take you into this page, and if you are logged into your account, you'll find a top right uh, at, at the top middle, sorry, here, a welcome back sentence with your name or your username. Of course, if you are now logged into your account, you'll find at the top right corner a sign in option instead of all those icons. If you click on it, you'll be able to log in into your account or even to create an account if you don't have one. Of course, you'll be able to do both options even with your Google account, Facebook account, or an Apple account if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of creating your account or logging in into your account, and it will be even much faster. So once you did one of those two options, you will find yourself here with this home page and as, as we said with the welcome back sentence. So of course, as we said in the beginning of the video, we would like to change our currency on Etsy website. So simply if you want to do that, just go to your account by clicking here at your account in the top right corner then click at account settings that will take you into this page and of course from here you would like to go and choose preference at the top here which is the third option once you click on that you will find yourself here with this page of course under default currency you can just choose whatever currency you would like to have here of course choose whatever currency you would like to have and then Whatever uh, you want to change, maybe other things, if you want to change, just go and change it. Change whatever you want. And of course, once you finish, just hit the update preference and everything will be updated. So this will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching it. Goodbye.